day for some that again hello and one in may watching now or later to haste this a bit uh, welcome uh, to Helian Saw with me, Helian, along with Drakir. And welcome back to Beyond Green Evil, which, well, we're starting here again because, uh, like I said last time, this game holds my keys hostage, so I can't, <laughs> I can't swap scenes. Uh, <clears throat> I can't swap between scenes uh, while it's busy. All Over right. Here. Last time we, well, we started the game and already we're part of, or we were invited to, we wouldn't exactly say we are part of yet, the uh, Iris Network, the uh, rebel organization who claimed that uh, the Alpha Sections are actually working with the Doms. Jade, you'll have to pick a code name to sign your articles with. Shawnee. That was quick. Yep. Keep up the good work, sugar. And one day, you just might come out of your shell. <laughs> uh, peepers. Uh, yeah. We're on the planet Hillis. Uh, wait. Oh. Okay, why is the... I'm not sure if that was visible on the stream, but it seemed like the FPS dropped a bit there. I... Uh, hmm. Okay, it seemed to happen there again for a second. Luckily, not more than a second. Yeah, um, I think I noticed it as well. Hmm. And what I, that? Yeah. Hmm. Oh. I'll have to look into what might be causing that. Normally, I'd have the task manager open on the side to see how the uh, processor and so are doing. But at the moment, well, not. Because, yeah, this is generally an older game, so it should, in general, run better. Yeah. Uh, but I think that it was a bit of footage of us fighting the, uh... I guess Sea Serpent would be the closest thing at the moment. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, now that we have a city pass, we can pass by these guys. Uh, why can't we go where yeah. we want to on the Hillis anymore? Citizen Protection calls an Impedus Volume 5? Okay, just quote a book at us, or a, a book title. Oh, okay. uh, yeah. Anyways, this is Ming Su's shop. We'll be coming here a few times as well. What? what? Yep, it's very oriental, as you can see. Oh, that sounds fine. I just did not expect the Volrus to run it. <laughs> uh, there we go. Walrus Sapiens. <laughs> Identified, dated, filed. And yeah, we'll be seeing a lot of uh, generic, uh, <laughs> generic replies with this, uh, you know, with the director of the science center. Also, we have another one, a koi uh, I believe, I believe this is just a normal koi fish. The inventory is coming along. Thanks again. But yeah, we are playing as Jade. This is Paige. Uh, we were attacked right at the freaking start of the game by the Doms. And uh, yeah, we in <clears throat> we got hired to photograph uh, quote-unquote Doms creatures, which turned out to be the eyes of one big fucking Doms creature. And yeah, we kicked its ass. Well, you more like kicked its eye. Oh, well. <laughs> And yeah, that was apparently a test to be allowed into the uh, Iris Network, who again claimed that the, well, the elite guard of the planet are actually traitors working with the Dom's creatures to kidnap people. But Jade isn't convinced yet. She's going to follow up on something that they've given her. Uh, to... But yeah, she obviously wasn't convinced yet. For now though, hello Minsu. Hello, miss. If you would like to buy something, I'll need to have your account number, please. Account yeah. identification. Okay. Okay, account identified. Thanks. Help yourself. It's my pleasure. <laughs> Why a walrus? Why not? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you were going to say something? 
I, I, all right. I, I was to say, they, they, in all the games where they want to choose an animal, I have a bit of culture. They usually use an animal that sort of at least common in that area. But this game, they say, screw it. You're making rhinos and Chinese walrus. <laughs> yeah. So you like haikus, do you? I have an excellent collection of works, miss. Why don't you, have, you know, go take a look in the storeroom? I think I'm, I might have, I may have a copy left. And yeah, we were, we were told earlier that Ming Zhu uh, sells the the newspaper of the Artist Network, so that is what they actually have in the back. Now, ah. whilst we're here, animal detector. Well done, Yeet. And this one is the pearl detector. They are pricey, but not extremely so. Well done, Yeet. If you'd been taking photographs of basically every new creature you saw, you'd be... well, you should have enough. Also, we're buying this. Well done, Yeet. <laughs> and we have enough for this. Okay. Now, let's go take a look here. And there we go. That's one disc, Iris 5.11. Iris 5.12. And as is clear, there are some open spots. These will fill in later. And hello there in the chat, King Leon 2626. I love I love playing this game. So do I. This game is one of my favorites. Impressive. Here we go. I keep copies of the latest issues from the Iris on MDisc. If you like, you can also subscribe you to the Iris Flash. That way you'll get live news flashes by email. Of course, everything's free for members. And I think I'll go ahead and take the issues from the Iris network. Perfect, I'll let you help yourself. Already did. <laughs> And let's subscribe as well. Perfect. There we go. Signed up. Now you'll receive the live news flashes. <laughs> and yeah, Ming Su sounds like freaking Cookie Monster. <laughs> they don't expect that voice. I'm not expecting them to do a, you know, typical Chinese voice. Welcome. You will now receive live news flashes from the Iris Network. <laughs> also, uh, let's double check here. Uh, yeah, the fact that my alias and the name Hillian are the same, that is actually, an, I've, I've talked about this previous stream as well, it's actually a, a happy accident because I used to play this game in the Dutch, na uh, uh, in the Dutch uh, dub, in which the, the, the term was actually with a small i instead of a, a Greek one. <laughs> So, yeah, I misspelled that and <laughs> accidentally made it match up with the English version <laughs> of the word. <laughs> this is going to stay amusing. All right. We can't go into there because our city pass doesn't have the correct, well, shape on it. But we will be able to go there eventually. And hello again, Montgomery Jack. <laughs> oh, hello, we can actually talk with you now. Much damage from the Dom's attack? The upper sections are here to protect us, miss. And the government has decided that pearls are illegal for, to use as money, miss. Yeah, okay, he's a bit... <laughs> he's a bit clueless on this. Hillis hmm. under fire from the Dom's meteors. The alpha sections are overwhelmed by the events. Read issue number 512 from Iris. <laughs> we'll take a look at those M-discs once we find, uh, Yeah, a reader somewhere. Now, I believe there was supposed to be... We did get a code from the Akuda, uh, Akuda bar about uh, a locker somewhere. But I think that is actually inside somewhere, or I forget at the moment. The army doesn't have much say in the matter since the Alpha sections arrived. Where do these Alpha sections come from? Mm -hmm. Don't ask me. All I know is that we're a lot better off since they took over. 
Yeah, you think so? Seems to me there's more and more kidnappings. Exactly. If it wasn't for them, there'd be even more kidnappings. Uh, mm. one of them is T-posing. <laughs> Not oh, anymore, at least. And, uh, wait, how the hell do you see what that thing on? Or, oh, uh, yeah, my point remains. How do you see with that thing on? Or, uh, or was that a pair of massive glasses or something? Now they just uh, made animations and they may actually skip the drawing the eyes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, what the fuck? That a hover car? It sounds like a hair trimmer. <laughs> okay, yeah. The, for some reason, I, okay, I think it might be because of just all the cars going around, but the frame rate is... Okay, now, yeah, I think it is because of how many things are moving on screen. And once again, I confuse <laughs> space and shift with each other again. Yeah. Either way, though, there is our objective. Yeah. And also, people, I feel a bit accidentally pushed today, since normally I drink from skulls, glass skulls, not real ones. But though today they're in the dishwasher, I just have to do well with the... They've even blocked off this passage. You used to be able to get to the factory direct from here. Rude pig. Rude. As I say, I'm... Drinking for a very... Uh, I, I would... Uh, uh, I guess you simply call it, call it an extremely fancy wine glass made of plastic that looks like it's made of crystals. <laughs> so yeah, yeah, I'm drinking oddly fanciful today. <laughs> Yeah, that is what happens if we try to get I in there. Neutralizing cannon at Mama Gold Garage for five pearls. That's exactly what we need. Before we go back to the Mama Goes, though, there are some other things over here that we can spot. Uh, which I believe should be around the bend here somewhere. If I remember correctly, there should be a little alcove here. And... Ah, there it is. And hello there. Yeah, this is one of the places where we can get a photo of this thing. The Teratosaurus Imperator. Identified, dated, filed. Yeah, and you'd think she'd have something to say about us getting a picture of uh, basically a fossil. Yeah, I, I, I can translate the, one of the Latin words from that. Yeah, imperator? Yeah, uh, uh, Sporus means lizard, but Imperator is basically means Emperor, if I remember right. Okay. Okay, it's, it seems that the, the game gets a bit choppy when it's looking in specific directions, like towards the city. Hmm. Now, there is something else around here, I think, that you could get a snapshot of. Also, uh, if we go beyond... Well, actually, we can't go beyond this barrier because, well, it, it's basically like a chain hung across a harbor. Uh, yeah, we we bump into it and just can't go on. Okay. Uh, All right. And, hmm. Okay, I have to say, I'm surprised you've not been crushing once in this game yet. <laughs> uh, crashing as in the game or just running into stuff? Running into stuff, Stans. You have a... Qu you say you're a good driver, but in games of many we've been playing so far, you're very good at crushing cars, tanks, airplanes, whatever you can drive. <laughs> okay, um, I think we should have enough pearls. Let's, yeah, we have six, so we can get the, the, the big gun right away. Hmm. I, I don't think we had, I don't think we had slowed on earlier.
Yeah, I, I don't think we had bits of slowdown last time, so I'm curious what's different this time. <laughs> hey, Sam. Yo, Jade, welcome to Mama Go Garage. Uh, th that's all the same. Yo, I think we forgot to talk to this one last time. Hey, Bebacar, how is it going? It's going. But we can't count on anyone but ourselves to protect us. The office sections couldn't care less what happens to us. Save and sound in its shell, the precious pearl is the slave of the currents. You know the password for... You? Mm-hmm. Be careful, Jade. And, yeah, we'll get to those Irish M discs in a bit. First, let's get our new upgrades. I don't, I don't know if I mishear you several times or I have expected you to accidentally miss, 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 uh, miss say Iris. <laughs> it sounds like you sometimes say Irish. <laughs> oh well. Yeah, let's take a look. 850 people have disappeared from the south side. That's a whole hell of a lot of people. Iris 511, a new wave of kidnappings in the pedestrian district. Reporter Double H. The Doms have once again struck hard at the Hillian population. Another 850 people have been reported missing since last week. The so-called protection given by the Alpha sections against the Doms attacks is derisory at best. I don't actually know what derisory means. Or <laughs> what it means specifically. <laughs> Look, that's a good question. And hello again in, ch in chat, uh, HS180. <laughs> uh, Hill is showered with Dom's meteors. So this one came out around the time that the game started. Hill is showered with Dom's meteors. Reporter, Double H. The canals, the Mamago garage, and the lighthouse shelter suffered a violent attack from the Dom's yesterday. The protective shields were not able to stop the Dom's meteors. The Alpha sections did not arrive on the scene until after the alert. The Alpha sections are incapable of assuring the protection of Hillis. Okay, not much really on, well, <laughs> evidence except for, well, <laughs> the obvious. Of course, they can only arrive after alarms go off and such. Also, that's irisnetwork.net. I think it used to be an actual website. Not sure if it's still on. But, uh, yeah, how are you doing in, uh, over there, HHS 180? I I'm probably just going to stick with HS whenever I, yeah, I'm going to refer to you. Yep. And yeah, what would be a new toy without something to test it out on? Or is this... Wait, isn't there supposed to be one coming down? Or... Oh, this is just meteor strikes. I, oh, oh, no, 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 no. Uh, but, uh, but my, okay, I did not go for a full... There it... Okay. Yeah, there's, there's a little fighter craft flying around. I don't actually remember these things. Uh, there, a green one. No, no, not that. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, that's what happens. There we go. Okay, I, I think in the past I've completely missed these things previously all the time. That or... Maybe they were not in the retail version of that I had? Hmm. Okay. What? Well, I, I guess we, <laughs> we learned something new. And... Okay, that's out of our reach, I think. Hmm. Oh, well. Oh, nope. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Careful, Jade. You're looking for trouble. Um, I think something is supposed to happen if you start harassing the... Uh, there they are. If you start harassing the civilian ships a bit too much. But let's not try and find that out. And it looks like that's the spider thing is, well, 
doing actually nothing. Except for being a nuisance. But how has it been a nuisance to you? Because it's just doing flybys and not actually attacking. Oh well. Let's just head over here. Because... Hmm? You sure does even attack the ship? It has a Dom's green glow on it. And now that we have this cannon... Bye-bye. <laughs> and then we can kick it while it's down. And just get rid of it completely. And yeah, obviously this thing lets us charge up a bigger blast and that can lock on to th three targets. Another cargo shipment lost. Hmm. Okay, I really should look into what is might be causing this slowdown. I didn't happen before. Maybe we were just lucky and miss anything that could cause slowdown. Maybe? Yeah, for now... Yeah, it, it seems that the more there is on screen, the more things slow down. That is odd. Because, again, lo uh, two days ago, that wasn't happening when we were passing through the city, I think. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, before we go back to the factory, there's actually a few alcoves like this one over here. They are hidden around the planet. So, let's go take a peek. And that quick flash... Would probably uh, well, it gave away what is in here for anyone who was quick enough to read it. And uh, yeah, these jackasses forcibly steal cash from you, and then we need to go chase after them. Wait, what? Yep. Thieves with police cars? Yeah, they could have just looted those as well. But yeah, like Paige pointed out, that spark is what starts the doors to close. We can't avoid that at all. Ow. Ooh. And yeah, oh, okay, that one got a bit close. If you're too slow, then uh, yeah, then the door is going to close on you. Uh, let's use a boost, and we get a bit of a straight point. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yep, there we go. And, well, then we just end up in closed places like this. And we get our cash back, plus an extra, and, well, a pearl. Looter's booty. Oh, dear. Don't, don't take that out of context, Alien. <laughs> so, yeah, e even if you do lose, it's only a small amount of cash that you lose. And, yeah, these boxes respawn. Should be a few others like that as well, but for now, ooh, ooh, okay, that was a bit. Sorry if that gave me on a bit of nausea. Yeah. <laughs> Let's move on. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, the fuck did... Thank you for your cooperation. Thank you the... for your cooperation. The hell was that noise? Okay. That was a machine. The previous one didn't make that noise while picking us up, so I think that might have been an audio glitch. Anyways, is that over there? Uh, it's not like the looters' caves, that's actually uh, an on-foot platforming area. But we have no real reason to go there yet, so let's just head to the factory. And take care of this friend. We could probably just leave it... <laughs> in the water to sink on its own, but oh well. And here we go. Huh. 
And yeah, we're in the factory, or at least we're in the outskirts of it. And you still and... not crashed your boat. There we go. Vorax Nocturnus. Vorax. We're seeing more and more of them these days. You could have gotten a picture of these early on at the start of the game. Uh, I'm pretty sure if you climbed to the... No, we couldn't get to the top of the lighthouse because the power was off. I, I think they... Yeah, they were flying around in the open area, so you could have gotten to them there. And there is something behind that grate, but Paige's tool isn't strong enough to cut through those, so there's no real reason to go um... that way. Oh, we left the alone. Yep. Are you there, Never mind. Johnny? Don't forget that the governor can help if you're having problems getting through a military door with a code. Just send her a picture of the cryptid signal. Yeah, just the game sending a reminder that you can do this. Yes, it's the code that we deciphered a couple of days ago. I'll send it to you. There we go. Just wait for a bit. And those... There we go. If he hasn't changed it, it's still that. Good luck! I think these might be randomized because they aren't actually physical objects that you have to collect. So, K4, Q6. K4, Q6. K4, Q6. And validate. Again, I don't get why they keep old codes saved up since, well, they're not reused as far as I remember. How do you see it? Doesn't look good, but there's some crates there. We've got to find out more. Okay. And yeah, now we're going to get into one of the main dungeons of the game. Let's go. The first page needs to open the place up. Uh, we might be able to fight pretty well, but still, these alpha sections are full-on military in power armor. So, yeah, we do not stand a chance against him in outright combat. Okay, we're gonna have to keep on our toes now, Jade. Don't worry, Uncle Page. We'll just take some pictures and get home. Shawnee, I've located the probable positions of the Alpha's activities. I've added them to your map for you to look at. Send us the pictures. So, yeah. Most of what we'll be doing is sneaking around. Also, Rattus Gigantius. Great, I can start a backup. A giant rat. Yep. And, well, the, the bit about the uh, background, yeah, the, the backup there, uh, implies heavily that we are not the only ones doing this. Okay. Wait, and hold on. A giant rat. A, beanie? a giant bitey rat. <laughs> Definitely a beanie. <laughs> uh, then he's not going to like this. You killed Beanie? <laughs> <laughs> There's plenty more. But yeah. Hang on, Jade! I'm coming! Hey, we're not uh, caught by uh, a Dom's monster this time, Paige, so there's no need for the dramatics. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Read it. And yeah, just another small puzzle here. Oh dear. Yeah, just gotta push this thing around and get it to those electrical poles. Oh. I'll never be able to do it by myself. You're gonna go and make me wear out my jet boots, Jade. The latest style in transportation. That's not all, Jade. That's not all. <laughs> <laughs> so much for their fancy security system. Yeah, because the edges of that thing are metal, and well, electric electricity arcs to the nearest contact point. A reaper. They're seeking a reaper on us. Looks like he's on the prowl. He must keep an eye on the ducks. 
It's getting too risky, Jade. We're needed back at the lighthouse. Let's stop while we still can. If the Iris Network is telling the truth, then this is where we need it most. CHHS. Well, it is possible to beat the guards with close combat. That is true. Uh, but you still use the general uh, methods of uh, the stealth. There, there is one way to get rid of them, uh, for which you have to d incapacitate them. But it, it is still pretty damn hard to actually beat them. Oh, in a straight up fight. For Ooh, now, dear. let's see. Well, that is obviously broken. And, uh, yeah, they've got quite the guard dog. <laughs> if the picture from uh, Double H was, is to be believed. Yeah. I have to say something about the voice actress of Yade. They sound fine, but there are some moments they sound off. Because I don't know if it's an audio issue or not. Yeah, that is something that has been said about the game. Yep, not wrong button. <laughs> Again, confusing shift and space. Maybe this old pig can't fly, but he's still got a bounce in his step. Yeah. She starts. Uh, so much for a bouncy page. Page. <laughs> Get over here, you. Uh, oh, come. Page. <laughs> Come here, you big fat porker. Okay. Uh, let's just... <laughs> let's just empty this thing out. Okay. And... Uh, let's select them. Just, there we go. No, not those. There we go. Here. You're going to need those more, but yeah, this place is also pretty broken up. So this play, this one is also a dead end. Man, that's what's making contact. Gotta get it pointed in the right direction. He's right there, but we don't have anything to throw at it. So we'll have to come back here. First off, though, this does not look like the best <laughs> thing to use as a map, but it's still enough. So for now, we need to head back. Hopefully without <laughs> Paige <laughs> smelling like bacon again. Yeah, also, what were you to say earlier about audio? Uh, I, I have heard it here and there that Jade starts off a bit uh, flat with her voice acting, but it does get better. And All right, that, that's probably what I'm reacting to. For other times, it just sounds just fine, other times, yeah, as you said, just weirdly flat. Okay, the West Wing. And I also interrupted you again, sorry. No problem. Oh, hey, what the? Yep, surprise. What did he, what, what did he call them? No, he, he didn't call them anything. He's... There were that's one of those old <laughs> ye oldy <laughs> exclamations of oh shit. <laughs> oh hello. Oh. Ow. I don't think we see these things too often actually. There we go. Uh, uh, let's see, H -H HS in chat. If you time your dodging, you have a chance if there is no choice. True. And there's no button in this service elevator. So we'll have pay we'll need to have Paige push the button. Luckily it only takes us up this far. And yeah, 
we'll be split off for a bit. And immediately we get ambushed. Though, well, electrical equipment near <laughs> robots, never a good idea. So nice yeah, we just need those detail. things like that. Oh, sorry. Uh, n <clears throat> yeah, n nice little detailing, and that is how you generally want to get rid of those bots. Yeah. You can see that. You can nice detail. And yeah, there's double H. Wait, what? Not listed too far one. Either way. Got it, Shawnee. That's the first proof. The governor will surely accept to give you the code. Uh, I not the time to check your posture. It, yeah. Right, that, that thing is whispering the same shit uh, into to him that it was whispering to well the the monster was to uh, Jade at the start of the game. Neutropil's factory secured locker. We should be able to find the code. I'll be in touch. It should work. Be careful. Okay, F5, V7, F5, V7. This, the spy world thing is neat, but it can also get a bit confusing. Yeah, it, it's, it's almost a bit unnecessarily fancy, but they probably also wanted to test out the new te tech of GameCube. And yeah, here we get one of our tools. Basically... <laughs> This thing is basically a souped up uh, nerf darts l launcher. Those things still don't like them. Oh, uh, you all right? Oh, oh, the pain. Oh, they turned my brain to jelly. Oh. Are, are you our contact? Are you double H? I'm not, not sure. Does the iris mean anything to you? Listen here, Miss Thyrus. Jade, my name is Jade. And I haven't the foggiest how we're gonna get out of here. Uh, for that, I may be uh, of some assistance there. So you are double H. Double H, triple Z, oh, whatever pleases you, don't ask me. All I know is that in another ten minutes, I was a goner. I owe you my life. Hence, you can count on me, Miss Thyrus. <laughs> Jade. My name is Jade. At your service, Miss Jade Thyrus. <laughs> And yeah, double H. We have a new companion. Also, we have an, a new shiny. Yeah. Doms. I, I can't get over Doms. Like, if I had played this you know, when I was a kid, I would not thought so much about Doms. But now, as an adult, I would know very too well that Doms is a... Sure for dominatrix and all that. <laughs> well, their whole thing seems to be to dominate. And uh, yeah. yeah, one little thing here, we can't actually give him a star course because he's wearing that stupid helmet with the gas <laughs> with the uh, 
the gas mask mouse. <laughs> yeah, it, 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 I'd say the helmet looks stu stupid. <laughs> Any bright ideas to get us out of here? Excuse me, Miss Cyrus, but I'm not exactly the best in the best state of mind to have any ideas. But I'm at your service. Because, yeah, we can order him to do an action. So, um... And... There goes our new companion. What? What kind of... Carlson and Peters? What? What kind of bad shorts is that? Uh, oh. For a moment of thought. Don't worry, everything's just fine. I'll find a way out of here. Well, he's dead. <laughs> uh, as I was to say, I looked at. I thought first you were walking in mid air. Uh. Uh. Yeah, Carlson and Peters, that's their uh, army manual, basically. Oh. And <laughs> uh, let's see, H uh, HS, that was a Leroy Jenkins joke. I think Leroy Jenkins was actually a thing after this game, but I'm not entirely sure. I think you're about right. Yeah, it's off the floor. Well, the fact was, when this game came out, there was no World of Warcraft. We're now... We're back here. And so is that thing. Hang on, Jade! Jet boots attack! Jade, need help! And uh, yeah. This is the Reaper. It looks a whole lot less intimidating like this, huh? Still, it's got page, uh, and it seems to have a taste for bacon. Oh, coming down. Who doesn't, Alien? Who doesn't? And yeah, we can get close. Yep. But we can uh, zap it. Also, yeah, we can find or grab this thing. Cyclopius Palutris. This monster has been extinct for thousands of years. Well, it's going to be extinct again. Okay, and simple gameplay loop. Dodge the ranged attacks. And then it tries to body slam you. Luckily, it can't correct once it starts. And there we go. Also, I think the tra this track is specifically called Don't Fear the Reaper, or Fear the Reaper. There's two <laughs> tracks by those names. Oop. And no, that isn't slow down. That's actually on purpose there. To, well, give you time to get the hell out <laughs> from underneath it. And yeah, we can just annoy it early by shooting it. And there we go. There we go. If we wait too long with any actions, it will try to eat Paige. So uh, there is some... <laughs> there is some uh, rush to this. Even if, as this thing Hulk jumps away again. Oop, now it's getting smart. Not smart enough. Also, oh, Paige must be getting fu- Oh, oh, hello, and fuck off. Hungry. 
I'm gonna regret saving you. <laughs> Here. Uh, that HS in chat. Uh, go ahead. I was it. I'm surprised he's not offended. Uh, I think he's been hearing these. We gotta find a way to get our hands on that pearl, by golly. Now, I think he's been hearing those jokes for a few decades. <laughs> Uh, HS in chat, when you buy monster energy at 3 a.m. Uh, yeah, we already know how I respond to a Red Bull light. Uh, and monster energy has a lot more freaking <laughs> caffeine in it than that. Yeah, uh, we received an like, email from I... Double H. You found him? That's remarkable. He said you shouldn't worry about him. He'll find his own way back. And, yeah, just confirmation that he's still alive. Somehow. Painfully. And yeah, I was also say, after Helian actually tried the Red Bull, we actually came to the conclusion that the recent stereotype about angry gamers drink, have seems to have a comment that they actually drink energy drinks. Yeah. Uh, one. <clears throat> uh, uh, harsh H chats, I know. Uh, I'll also run a bit of a test with that. <clears throat> uh, yeah, one can of Red Bull has about 100 milligrams of caffeine in it, and it already made me really easily agitated. And I know those monster energies have like four times that. It, it's yeah. little. I, I checked one yesterday whilst I was in the stores, and they actually recommend you to not drink the entire fucking thing in one go. <laughs> it it says. <laughs> There's an advice at, on the back, of course, only in the small letters, to only drink like half of one at the maximum per day. Yeah. It actually reminds me of something that happened when Energy Drink just came out. In any case, but, that's where we gotta climb up. Right. This was back when Energy Drink was new, before they had regulation on them. A schoolmate got arrested by police for the fault she was drunk. And she was about 14 years old. 14 or 13. Then I realized she was not, not drunk. She was high, just overhyped from a energy drink. Yeah. Okay. And basically. Are you in this conversation, uh, Porky? There's no juice, Jake. No red food for you. <laughs> anyway, I was saying. Shortly, a few months after that, came the first regulation of you need to be this old to be allowed to drink energy drinks. Yeah. Also, I believe there's a bit of text that will appear if we get. Okay. Yep. Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle, of a personal jade. Even the leaders have been screwed with. Hang in there, old buddy. Uncle Page will make it all better. You think you can fix it? I'll give it a go, but don't be expecting any miracles. Took one heck of a jolt to look at that cable. It's gonna be needing a new beater, too. It's up to you to find an organ donor. A fuse. Hmm. Well, where do you expect me to find a fuse around here? Gotta have one. He's in bad shape. As per the piston, did what it could. Just put the thingamajig back into whatchamacallit. <laughs> uh, uh, HS, Dutch version, krijg nou. <laughs> bleep, bleep, bleep. Wait, what? Uh, and... Also, HS, uh, I've I actually com I've actually completed this game without any PH ones as a challenge to myself. So no, I I don't need to uh, keep I don't need to hoard all of them to myself. And okay, you're not okay. No bacon this time, huh? But yeah, come on. There we go. And now there, this thing has power. There we go. Ah, this room. I, I, I like the music that's going to be here, and... Jade, fuses ahoy! Just what we need to fix the Vader! 
But you can take a guess what would happen if we tried to grab it like this. New haircut? We need a special key. And yeah, we don't have the key for that. Luckily, though, it's... Ah, one special key for Miss Jade. Coming up. Suspiciously close by, huh? Yep, it's an egg robot. Just say when, Jay. Egg boot. <laughs> and yeah, when it's rolling. Oh. Yep. There we go. It's, when it starts, well, doing that, it's going to blow. You calling that a guardian? Scanalize. Okay. One triangular key, gotten, and there's another fuse here. But yeah, as long as those things are, oh, aren't glowing red, they're harmless. Or oh, oh yeah, there was definitely uh, quite a bit of slow down there. Yeah, there. Okay. I think this might be the only place where this piece of music plays. Very nice music, I say. Yeah. Oh, almost. There we go. That's how we destroy that. Uh, if we miss that, we there's no way to get that PH1 that's behind there. Okay. Hmm. Okay, the frame rate definitely seems to not like these things. Or doing this. It, hmm, that's odd. Yeah, it might. I might have accidentally turned something on or off. And there we go. That's the last one going. And we take that. Good work. And we get ourselves healed. Now, let's try this again. Hopefully without another ambush. Automatically get selected. And there we go. Two fuses when we only need one, actually. Perfecto. I've scanned it. So this one doesn't really look into being the best condition. <laughs> I know what it said there. Helian norms. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I so think I... we might need to abandon one of them. Oh since dear. The... Actually, actually, no, the gate should be open there still. But yeah, yeah taking uh... out the fuse makes everything oh safe dear. here. Oh dear. Also, before I forget. It's, it's gonna take quite a lot of time to get used to, to see Helian's name pop up so many times. <laughs> also, this isn't really made too obvious, but other than the fact that this specifically gets pointed out by this, the cable connector, energy fuel, molecular links broken, increased weakness. Yeah, because even with the fuse, this would still need power. So let's put this in. That's it, Paige. I was able to put in the. Accidentally skipped some dialogue. Accidentally skipped some dialogue, but oh well. If you ask me, we 
you did one heck of a job, partner. Don't go getting too excited there, Jade. You ask me, the fat lady hasn't sung yet. Yeah, I don't think your singing would be any good anyways, Paige. Oh, come on! Really, yeah, that's, that, that was a sheep shot. Even for yeah. you. And, well... This doesn't look very good. Uh, by the way, Jade, here. This came for you the other day. Better have a look at it. Why didn't you tell me sooner? It's probably a mission. Uh, yeah, probably. Sorry. But with everything going on lately... Yeah, come on. Um, well, that lady has sung her last song. Okay. Let's go. First encounter of a two-button door. Standard stuff. Press both at the same time. And yeah! Doms! And yeah, these motherfuckers can teleport in! Look at that! Yeah, they look unsettling. <laughs> Not too bad, sugar. Without you, I'd be smoked ham by now. And yes, I was trying to get a picture of them. For now, though, let's see. You can't go that way. Uh, level two grid, iron, too thick for those, because they are just basically frisbees. Uh, aluminium silicon fibers, reinforced steel. Definitely not getting this through that. Hmm. Also, what's on the disc? Yeah, we'll have to find a reader first. Now, I believe... Oh, right. Wait. I remember there being something here that should be able to move around. Hmm. Ah. Stay hidden, Jade. We gotta find out what we're up against first. Okay, we'll be right back. Now, no waving of a goodbye. <laughs> Oh dear. And yeah, here we are. There's another code there. And hello. Yeah, there's people in those crates. And the alphas are overlooking them. So, seems like Iris might have had a point. Also, Wait, yeah, these are banana. So, a white rat. I think yep. you saw. Wait. No, can't be. Could it? Hmm? Could it have been a pink in a brain reference? <laughs> Maybe. What I do know is that thing is the only of its kind in the game, I'm pretty sure. So we need to get close enough without scaring it off. There we go. Rat is Albus, an albino rat. Thanks again, Jade. Quite a bit of cash. <laughs> Not worth that we're short of that anyways. It require a lot to make it run away from you. That's a no-go. And we're at a dead she, end. She should be able to fit through that. Should, but That's sadly no can't. So we'll just have to go back and find another way. So we're kind of trapped here. I find it annoying. Like, if you want to bore off and first of all be able to go through an area, do proper fencing. The fence secret, low biological activity detection. And yeah. The fence secret, organic matter, heat emission, weak point in their breathing tank. Yeah, that's their weak spot. 
Also, really, how many times have there been good guys wearing bl full black with skulls? But yeah, let's head back to Paige and find another route. I'm trying to think about it. I think it's. Again. No, uh, something on the floor. Yep. Parfait. I stock it. It's the PH1 we gave him. Okay, that's nice. So we get it back. For now, though, let's uh, just <laughs> let's get after him before they stick him into one of those canisters. Uh, yeah, probably a good idea. Let's see. I think I've seen games where someone is in black armor and the good guys, but Golos and black armor? Yeah, I don't think I know that many. Also, Loses. this hasn't come into action yet, but we can move side to side when using the camera. Oh dear. And, I... yep. Actually, the closest thing with black armor and skull to good guy probably would be either 40, 40k warm fantasy. Yeah, and even then, but, good guy is debatable. Yeah, especially when it comes to 40k. <laughs> Someone in black armor being good guy with skulls probably would be a knight of more. Basically, a knight dedicated to kill vampires and gra god graveyards. Okay. So, like Kelimvor from a certain Dungeons and Dragons universes. I believe Forgotten Realms? Uh, they, they misused, they misused Blackguard. For Blackguard is a, is a term for someone that got night that got graveyards. But in Dungeons and Dragons, mm. they used to turn into evil paladins, where they're not supposed to be evil to begin with. Okay, didn't know that that was the original <laughs> meaning for Blackguards. Which is yeah. usually said black art, like with, without EG. And HS in chat, actually, she is kind of thin enough to go past the iron bars, but game 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 logic disagrees. Yeah, so yeah. he just he agreed with you on that. Yeah, so I now agree with you, lad. For it, Jade. A bit of pit peeve. Ooh, for Jade. Personal hey. message. Okay. Jade. You inherited generosity and courage from your parents. You know, I think about them a lot. We were very close friends. 20 years ago, we were forced to separate because we were all having some major problems with the authorities. Your parents put you under my care to save your life. We came to Hillis. Back then, it was a peaceful planet. I had hoped to raise you there safely. But the conflict spread. Now, you must know something. If I was able to get here, it was thanks to the Beluga, the spaceship that I designed and built with your father. It still exists, but I haven't exactly finished getting it back in top shape. You'll find the checkup report on my desk. The Beluga is at our place. You have to enter a code into each one of the consoles to open the secret hiding place. I can't say any more on this M-Disc about it, but I hope this information will be useful to you if, one day, you have to use the Beluga. No matter what happens, good luck, Jade. Uncle Paige.
he he knew he was risk he was getting risky of uh, getting captured then I guess. Yeah. Dear. So we have to hunt him down now. Miss Tyrus. Oh. Hello. There are guards all over the sector. Whatever you do, don't get caught. We'll meet up a little further along. Hmm. Something Is I think I've only just noticed. Uh, uh, he has green eyes, Paige has green eyes, and Jade has green eyes. Interesting. I was noticing just his face looks a bit off. Like, maybe just, a, just an animation, but it looks like Double H had a lazy eye. Uh, well, he has been... Uh, he was... The contact with him was lost four days ago, so he has been in that torture machine probably for 72 hours straight. Oh, dear. Yeah. And HS in chat, crying emoji. Wait, they came to uh, me or to Paige, uh, but never met them. Yeah, he's talking about Paige... Uh, not Paige. Iron Jade's parents there. Because, yeah, she's very obviously not Paige's uh, daughter. Poor blood relative. Shawnee, Double H has informed us about Paige. He has seen him in the hands of the Alpha sections. Hang in there, Jade. Wrap up your report. That's the only way of saving Paige. That sounded flat. Uh, I believe that's the... Uh... Yeah, I believe that's the governor as a voice actor. She's actually the one directly sending those uh, messages about the codes to us and other stuff. Also, can we go into the camera here? Yes, we can. And okay, the hell are you two guarding? <laughs> the incinerator? Yeah, I, I believe... I believe there were plans to have... Pay to have Jade's parents appear in Beyond Good and Evil 2, or at least one of its the concepts for Beyond Good and Evil 2. But, yeah, that football has been kicked around back and forth so often that, uh, yeah. Ah. Well. Wait, uh, who, who owns the right to this game? Ubisoft? Ubisoft, right? Yeah. They, and, they well, did with some trailers more recently. Uh, recently, as in a few years back, I think. Um, it Ubisoft was talking about selling uh, to someone else, right? I know that uh, Square Enix sell sold a lot of their stuff recently and stupidly went into the, into the NFT business the moment that the market crashed. <laughs> But, yeah, Ubisoft is in talks or something, I believe. So that does have me worried that uh, whoever buys the rights, or just outright buys the studio, if that happens, the um, question is, will be if they will continue development on Beyond Good Evil 2, or if they might can the project. Oh dear. He was happy that Embrace Company has always outright stated they're going to revive many franchises and they just quoted as they found the first fighters to revive to be Legacy of Cain. Okay. Yeah, I, I heard that they bought the rights and the Embracer Group are the parent company of THQ Nordic who are behind, who are the creators of the Darksiders series. So, yeah. I... I... I expect that will go quite well. Uh, yeah, and they uh, also said they're going to revive Tomb Raider. Not that it really needs a, re a revival, but more Tomb Raider I'm not going to complain about. Yeah, and as I also said, Thief as well. That one is definitely a surprise. Someone I well, someone I barely know, I, I, I always have difficulty saying if I should say if I quote-unquote know somebody, or yes, that generally is a bit more intimate than... Yeah, just being aware of someone, an acquaintance or such. Um, 
either way for the moment uh, hs in chat lol hearing an audio mail while coughing and crouching behind really deaf guards <laughs> i presume that jay just has an earpiece or something that she actually gets that it's through and yeah there's a lot of people being shipped through here Oh dear. Oh uh, dear, again. I hope Embrace will not disappoint. Since so far, they just promised to revive. A lot of franchises people want renewal and properly made. I, I like how uh, Jade holds the camera in her hands for a while after you use it. And we could kick this guy in, well, not really in his ass, a bit higher up. But these guys aren't completely deaf. If one of them gets injured, the other is going to hear it. So these two are getting kick, getting off a uh, kick free. And yeah, in case we do get spotted, there's these uh, hidey holes. Though I guess we could call them more open sewers. <laughs> All right, let's see. Actually, looking at them, I think I know, have a good nickname for them. Yeah. Envy, because <laughs> they see in green. Uh, budget Space Marines. <laughs> uh. HS and chat, passive run? Not really, it's more that uh, I want to avoid getting shot at. And, well, <laughs> I'd rather not have them go after my ass in the first place, even if we are getting a good enough view of that. Okay, just another hidey hole. Oop. And I do be uh, believe they will hear you if you are walking around too close behind them. And this this guy's shadow is a little... He's actually hovering like an inch or two off the ground. <laughs> I think. Or at least according what to his shadow. The heck? Oh no, his shadow is off. <laughs> okay. Um, yeah. Old game. That is weird. And yeah, if we kicked him, this is what happens. Because... Yeah, we're, he's kind of choking now. And if we do it again... He takes up like a freaking firework. Wait, where did he go? Wait, can you look up? Uh, he wins from the freaking ceiling. What? What? Uh, what? Uh. what? 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 Uh. Old game. <laughs> Oh, hello, Double H. Miss Tyrus, I'm blocked by the flames. And yeah, we already know that shooting these turns them off. There we go. Only temporarily, of course. And yeah. Yes, sir. The panel for this one is over there. So, oh, that's very quick. Cyrus, in case you have no other choice in the matter, you can sneak up behind the guards and strike them on their air tanks. That's their Achilles heel. We'll meet up further on. <laughs> yeah, just to inform you that you have the option. I'll turn those off, and uh, well, I guess he's stuck. <laughs> And again, good music that actually fits. Oh yeah. And there's one over there. Actually, the, the entire game plays very, very cinematic. Ow. 
Bye bye. Okay, that that <laughs> that should have been here earlier. Uh, yeah, it's that one. The previous one flew through the ceiling, though. <laughs> yeah, without doing any sort of uh, falling debris, you just fell uh, off. But this one up, at least mean. broke the roof. Uh, wait, wait. Yeah, uh, he blew up. And okay, that one must have heard the yep. <laughs> blowing up because he was agitated. Uh oh. Oh dear. Oh dear. Okay. Now we're going to get things a bit trickier. Uh, wait, wait, this wait, guy wait, just wait. turns I, around. I, I know the perfect distraction. Pre subway at the kitchen. <laughs> no? This isn't I, hungry. I think they do have some peripheral vision still, so best to go when their back is turned. And okay, now we have blue lasers as well. And now we're down here. Calling all guards. Hold your positions and stay on alert. Intercept and destroy. Yeah, they don't mess around, do they? And there's also this little cubby hole over here or no, okay, this is this just goes straight back to here. Just a shortcut. There should be a there should be a side passage here somewhere. It has some goodies in it in it. And yeah, this place is too open to get across safely, except for well this. And don't think that we are safe just because we are on the uh, other side of this thing. Uh, they actually have a ranged attack. Which can be pretty freaking accurate if I recall correctly. Nope, oh, gotta keep in mind these things speed up and slow down a bit. For some reason she reminds me of a floppy from a Hero Academia at the moment. <laughs> well, she is jumping around like a frog a bunch. And I believe this is that cubby hole. Yeah, the closet. Uh, really? <laughs> the closet? Uh. Yeah, which has a bit of a red infestation. Oh dear. Oh, and for I some reason a vending machine. I seriously want to hear how Bean responds to this sometime. <laughs> Okay. Identification. Okay. More food for Jade to stuff herself with. Completely restores your energy. A star ghost restores one heart of your energy. And there's also this here. What was that? Traces of Blabera, very greedy insects. So if we just keep some distance, I believe. Or we need to go back even further. Uh, let's see, that's not where we came from. Okay, long distance. And is it back? It's... Oh, oh, now I remember. Now I remember. Because notice that the UI just pops up. Yep. <laughs> Little bugger has come to steal our food. Blabera <laughs> uh, Gregaria. Splendid picture. <laughs> Uh, HS, uh, it is a spy game, so yeah, cinematic is everywhere. Okay, your roll of film is finished. Good. I'll transfer a pearl to you, Jade, and mm. I'll recharge your film. Yeah, that's our fourth roll of film already. Yeah, I didn't think of this is actually is a spy game. I guess you're right there, lad. Yeah, it, it's, it's a mixture of many genres, which is probably why people remember it, because it mixes a lot of things, and... No, it doesn't screw them up too much. Yeah, 
Yeah, this is good for... It can be good to mix genres with some games sometimes, but you need to be careful when you do it. Yeah. Like, we've seen some games do it before and do it well, and these little shits respawn. So uh, even more to make Beanie upset. Uh, oh dear. One case was uh, Giants in Kabuto, which mixed genres. And... Hmm. Can we yeah, get do, over did, to that guy? Did they do it really some... well, though? Mm, mo mostly, I'd say. I need more proof, Shawnee. Wrap up your report first, and then I'll send you the code. Yeah, we are still missing one photo. Also, rude. We need those rude? photos, Shawnee. The contents of the black cases, the alpha sections without their helmets on, and we'll be able to publish issue 513 of the Iris. Good luck. Yeah, to avoid you, well, getting out before you uh, are done. I literally yeah. drop the helmet when they fly up. <laughs> yeah, it's debris that's falling down, uh, which is a bit less gory than what they probably should be showing since, well, they're blowing up. <laughs> um, I mean, I thought I saw a face. Uh, I think it's just some random debris bits that come flying down. And they just again yeah, the bug. Yeah, boy, let's party. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because that should probably feed them for a week or something. Uh, yeah, we need to go this way through a, a fat, uh, a fat full of uh, cape bubs, and well, there's that guy who's not moving around. So, what do you do with the guard that isn't going anywhere? I'm going. You distract him. Ooh, 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 I did not. Oh, he's hearing me run. Okay. But yeah, that's how they look when they are suspicious. Ooh, okay, he pulled that out real quick. <laughs> so yeah, he's heading over to the switch. In the meantime, we can get around him. Get the hell out. Oh, I think... I think he got a glimpse of us. Also... Arachnus Veritas. Transmission received. I'll file it right away. Spider. Yeah, green spiders. So, yeah, these just... These just bolts. Hello. Surveillance footage. HS, a green little metagross. <laughs> it does sort of resemble them, and <laughs> hello. Pages jet boots. He seemed rather attached to them. Never let me take a close look at them. And I guess that was the Starcos we handed him over. And it beyond that, that he, he cooked and ate him. Okay, we already got that. Beyond that, though, this place is blocked. So. Uh, of course. And out. What to do you want of these? Oh, yeah, these things are generally harmless enough since after a few hits, you bend their gun to point upwards, making them harmless. So we do one over there. And then we send the other one over here.
Well done! Well done! Yeah, they're pretty easy. Now, one of these is optional. So I believe if you get... If you destroy both of them... Uh, actually, no, the only way to destroy them is to uh, punch them into the electricity. So, no, that wouldn't be what... Uh, for a moment, I thought if you uh, just both destroyed them, that new ones would spawn. But no, the only one, to, the only way to get rid of them is to well blow up the barricades. <laughs> well, that's one way to do, do a puzzle. Ooh, another M disk. Thank you. Alien armor data bank. Army. <laughs> <laughs> maybe I should rename the uh, maybe I should rename this their discord server to uh, Hillian uh, base or something <laughs> or Iris base something uh, I am considering commissioning someone to make some beyond good and evil themed or styled after the beyond good and evil style uh, overlays for like well around up around here everything and a pre-screen and end screen. I'll still have to figure that out with that person, though, and they likely won't be ready uh, by the time we'd be done with this game, though. But hopefully our next stream, or the next game, may have a new uh, look around this. Okay, surveillance record. West Sector Factory Crate Contents. And this one's actually a video, not a <coughs> animated bit. Bastards. Property of the Hillian Army, Carlson and Peters Manual, D&D, Defense and Detection, Inventory 01. To Opus 23, Defense and Detection, Regular Army, OR, Organic Resources, Equipment, Laserproof Armor, Perforating Helmets. Alpha Sections, Elite Units, also OR. Laserproof armor, a T hammer, and respiratory autonomy. Weak point in their breathing tank. You'd think they'd put a bit of armor over that. Electric barriers, 380 volts, DND, depends on detection. Removable self powered generators for blocking small passages. Cyclopius unit M39, also DND. Defense laser, force 5. Anti shock armor, warning, keep clear of electric fields. Transport Unit XB24, D&D. Surveillance, Transport Small Objects, Light Armor. Invulnerable when glowing. Defense Mines, D&D. Protection of Aquatic Accesses. We've, si we've seen these in the Looter's Cave. And we will see them plenty more in the Looter's Caves. Or what the... Yeah. Surveillance robots, D&D, perimeter security, defensive shooting, twin gas propulsion, attention, weak point in the propulsion tanks. Yeah, they are being a very bit, a bit obvious with these weakness, huh? Laser turrets, D&D, defense laser, force 5, blind shot. As in, it can't actually detect anything, so it just constantly fires everywhere. Torpedo launcher, D&D. Guided uh, torpedo, uh, guided torpedoes, inertia coefficient eight. Isobaric case, extra helium convoys, transport all types of living organisms in the in a state of lethargic control. Uh, I don't, I wouldn't consider Paige in the footage to have been lethargic. <laughs> but yeah, that, that's basically because he's too big for them. It's basically a, a stasis pod. M5 laser turrets, D&D. Detect and follow intruders. Defense laser, force 5. Barrier alarm, D&D. 
Activate, deactivate in case of alarm. Inoffensive and ineffective against military armors. Permanent barrier. D&D. Inoffensive and, uh, and inoffensive and ineffective against military armors. And then there's surveillance module. Rapid securing of a zone. Activation with radio authority, uh, authorization. And big detection drone. Perimeter surveillance, radio connection with torpedo launcher. Meaning, if these things see you, uh, you're going to have something chasing after you. Yeah, that's also in order, uh, one of the early ones. Oh? Uh, I think it might be a description here. See, on the, one of the elite units. Okay, there. Yeah. Okay, T hammer. Does that look like a hammer to you? Now, if they have, if they use the other uh, end, it, it would basically be like a an, an elongated claw hammer. Claw hammer. It looks more. All right, I can see what you mean with claw. Though, yeah, for a moment, it looked more like an axe to me. And yeah, with the guy that's uh, over that way. When he pulled that thing out, he did have the front, the flat side facing us. So the model, in the summary, holds it wrong. Ah, okay, okay. That's why I got confused then. <laughs> uh, HS again. Wow, the legendary HD quality security camera footage. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 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 Pardon? And also, uh, I tell you, of all parts in the game, meeting those flying two sacks uh, thing is for me the annoying thing in the game. Because, yeah, we will be facing at least one of those, I believe. For now, though... Yeah. We can't open that. Because, well, we could make a square out of triangles, but we'd need four triangle keys for that. So instead, we head this way. Simple timing puzzle. Not really sure why they would have that there. Though, yeah, the Alphas could just walk straight through. Speaking of... Yeah, they can, they can spot you pretty damn fast. Though they yeah, also yeah. give up pretty fast. Yeah, I saw that you're right. They are holding the hammer correctly there. Yeah, again, they can spot you really quick. So you have to stay on your toes. Even more rat murder. I believe, yeah, we can get up here. Oop. Okay, this one is alone. Um, there's also another way of dealing with the alphas, or at least weakening them. Yep. Have a nice flight. And, yeah, those inactive barriers that we've been seeing here and there, if we are, if if they do spot us and they actually identify us as threats, those will turn on to trap us. And yeah, here we have two of these guys. And since we have a little hidey hole here, I can show off something that they will do if there's two of them nearby. First off, of course, that is going to set them off. They'll actually fix each other's systems. Okay, that's kind of nice. Actually kind of unique. Yeah, I, I don't think, uh, of course, in some games, uh, enemy characters will assist each other, but... Yeah, there's not too many of them that where they uh, fix each other's breeding systems. Yeah. In a lot of games, the enemies don't really have 
uh, breeding systems to repair, but still. Yeah, usually they just heal each other or support each other, like above, but walking up and repairing in this manner, visually? Hmm. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, that's a rarity. Yeah, also, you could hear them squeaking around with something whilst they were fixing it. The question is, how do we get the fruit of one without helmet? Yeah, we'll just have to keep looking. Ooh. Uh, camera's being a bit sensitive with going up and down. Okay, that guy isn't going to turn around. So we just have to sneak in behind these. And of course we'll have to be careful with him over there. And of, of course if there are hidey holes again for us to disappear into and we can stop crouching here. Okay, it's being really... It really doesn't want to move as much here. Hmm. Also a bit late on another of HS's uh, posts. Uh, then, a, yeah, then can a block of cheese? Uh, though I, I don't think they'd accept uh, cheese as a, <laughs> as a passcode cards here. Will they accept it as a bride? <laughs> bride? <laughs> Bribe, <laughs> not bribe. Uh, but maybe if the alphas are a bunch of rats stacked into a, inside of an armor like a trench coat. But no. Wait. What if they are rats? Well, yeah. The, the thing to do here is to get on top of one of, or to cling to one of these crates. There we go. And we get safely moved around. Safely? Well, <laughs> better than getting <laughs> crushed. There we go. Uh, I never checked this, but the box should disrupt the electrical current here. Okay. Now it blocks it, but it doesn't redirect it like we, it did with the box that we moved at the start. Uh, let me do it. Okay, we still have plenty of time. Still, just for safety. <clears throat> Pardon. What the... Um, I think we found one without helmet. Yep. But how, how do we fall to him? And we'll have to get a good angle. Then HS again, sneak 100. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Jade is a sneaky one, but then again, these guys have probably the, <laughs> the same amount of vision as a one-eyed goldfish. Well, why does it look like a one-eyed zombie goldfish? Okay. There we go. Oh, this one's getting stuck. Oh dear. <laughs> okay, more spiders, and for some reason these things move. Not the heck, lad. You? Oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. Look at their 
beasts, they're no longer human. They're controlled by the Doms. We must inform the entire population of this. Quick, send a picture to the Iris Network. I'll get you know, looking for a way in. Mm. And you were going to say? I was say, just to say, don't forget to foot, uh, photograph him. But don't hate him and you fool me. Yep. Nice work, Shawnee. We'll publish it. I'll send it to the governor and she'll send you the code for the loading dock. And now... Hmm. Sooner or later. Yep. We go through here. Ah, uh, yes. Oh, come on. He's phasing partly through, <laughs> through the bridge. Okay. And, well, here we just have to sneak between these guys because they're dumb enough to turn away from each other. The truth about the horrific human traffic at the Neutropils factory. The proof in issue 513 from Iris. I think we've got it. Try that one. Yep. Yeah. Since we already scanned it, we're getting the code now. M7P8. I think we've got it. Yep. <laughs> hit the wrong key there. Okay. Don't think there's anything down here. Let's crouch just in case they do have line of sight into here. Okay. Ooh. Well, we're not going to be able to hide behind that. Let's see, is there any one of you nearby? Nope. I... Okay, that luckily doesn't make any noise. And... Enjoy the view! <laughs> yeah, technically there should be a shower of green gore with that, but uh, luckily enough for the age rating there isn't. <laughs> You actually suspect it to allow green gore. Yeah, that was one way for companies to get around mature ratings by changing all blood to green. Also, for some reason, they can't see through this. Weird. If we'd gone there, the other uh, one would have seen us, I think. So we just gotta wait for both of them to be facing away. And then we can steal whatever's in here. Which is exactly what we need, of course. Perfecto. I scanned it. And, well, now we just have to get back to that door to get out of here. Now I might have been spotted there. There we go. And out. Yeah, the camera likes to hang really low during these stealth sections. And now we're back here. And we can't actually get into the camera in these transition bits. But these were on before. Which is why we went that way. Or were they on? I'm not sure if they were on, but we would have been facing a, a closed door there anyway. So I think they were on to not have us waste our time. Okay, and now... We're here again. Okay, uh, let's see. M7P8. Okay, M seven P eight. 
Now that I actually think about it, it, it might not be that these are randomized after all, because some of these are actually familiar to me. Or I think they are. Hmm. Maybe say it remembers when you do a game plus or something. I don't think this game has new game plus, and now we're over here. We were up there before, but we couldn't get through. Though, yeah, it seems like a bit of a dead end. And let's see, uh, HS, uh, zombie gore, and a out of bound safety, I guess. Um, not entirely sure which one, uh, which bit you mean with that. For now. Nope. It's always a bit shaky there, and hello. Your Excellency. The problem has been taken care of. My best men have found and neutralized all of the intruders. Uh, everything's under control, Your Excellency. I'll take care of this minor detail myself. Uh, uh. Wait, 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 hold. Oh, come on. Cheater. And welcome to another one of my favorite tracks. Oh, and HS meant for people that want to cheat with you know, going through walls cheats. Uh, okay, yeah, that's why, I'd, that's what the passwords are for, or something. <laughs> yeah. And, yeah. This, I think, shows how dangerous the dumbs can be if they can assimilate tech. Nope. Oh, come on. Oh. Come on. And there is double H again. And yeah, the way we defeat this thing is we knock each other with speed, don't get hit on the way back down, and then we poke it in the eye. Ow. But yeah, I, li I like this music track because of just how animalistic it sounds. Uh, ow. Yeah, it's going to get more difficult to be knocked down. Oh, it it actually caught itself there. Ow. Okay, gotta be careful with... I'm actually going to use one of these. Ow. Did I actually get a shot in there? I think so. <laughs> Okay, that was completely an accident. Uh, there we go. <laughs> it had never happened before. It was a complete accident because again, I accidentally hit the shift key. <laughs> yes, 
and there we go. <laughs> that deals with that. And another infected pearl cleansed. Page. They've taken Page! If it wasn't for you, it would have been me they took for a free ride in one of their luxury coffins. Turn ticket not included. I'll find you, Page, no matter what. Hang in there. Uh, <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> and yeah, that's the boss of the slaughterhouse done. Terrorist strike attempted by the Iris Network at the Municipal Nutripills factory. Thanks to the Alpha sections, the production line was fortunately saved, and a part of the gang of hoodlums were imprisoned. Hmm. Sure. Uh, something went. Oh, sorry about that H1, uh, or HS. Uh, okay, it seems that Nightbot uh, is set to stop posting links, but apparently it also just completely deleted everything you posted there. Uh, I can still see it on my end. Uh, ta -da -da -da. Let's see. It, this, is, this is the only scene where I think that the main evil and it cuts off there. Okay, I, I don't know why it's... I don't know why it's removed everything. But I did get a glimpse of that earlier. Uh, okay, I, I'll set. I'll see about setting Nightbot to allow links. Uh, but yeah, you were saying something about there being the only scene where the Dom's or, or, or Dom's lieutenant does something stupid by killing the uh, the, high, the general guard. We can get out through there, Miss Jade. Let's not forget. The slaughterhouses are blocked by the military over there, aren't they? Affirmative. They think there is an access from one of the races taking place near the slaughterhouses. The track passes right underneath the surrounding wall. Here. And that should help him hopefully a bit. And of course, what's a boss fight without a health container at the end? Perfecto, I've scanned it. I think you may need it. And we already have that key, so we can call this elevated around. We should still have some time. Okay, about 13 minutes because we started late. Wait, how? how how much remain do you have? Do we have? Uh, 12, 13 minutes. And... All right. I mean, my brain derped that. For, for my, somehow my brain translated that to 30. Okay. Um, let's actually go up back to that M disk reader so I can save the game. Then I can try and escape, have my mouse escape from the game so I can turn Nightbot uh, off so you can post that uh, clip you made. Uh, but that that might risk screwing up the game a bit because, yeah, it's an old game and it's, an, it's a port from a console. So, of course, it's going to be a bit jittery with some stuff. So, you give me a moment on this because I actually have to open up the task manager to get that... Uh, to free my mouse. Uh, let's see. Nightbot, Nightbot. It should be one of these tabs that I have opened. Yep, Nightbot. Uh, ta -ta -ta. I, I think I think Nightbot mostly blocks links because of those uh, one of my followers bots and all of that bullshit. So, let's see. Uh, spam well, protection. I, I, I suspect he's also going to try to block people from the linking harm from links. Uh, let's see. Da -da -da. This is the list of allowed links. Entry, da -da -da. You can allow entire websites or specific links. Okay. So if I put in Twitch, I should actually spell it correctly. 
twitch.tv, then I should be able to. Uh, I should be able to allow that. Just in case I'm going to turn off the timeout length, just in case it does screw up. So there, submit. Uh, oh, it must be greater five second timeout then for the moment. Uh, can you try posting that link again then, HS? <laughs> you, I'm, I'm guessing the clip you made was of that lucky shot, which I have to admit that was a really freaking lucky shot. Huh. Oh, oh I see. It's clips.twitch.tv. Um okay I'll 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 disable the link the, the 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 links bot for a bit. So after the timeout runs out there, you should be able to post it finally. Though I don't get why it I don't get why it removes all of your me previous messages on that because it's showing the first mo message that was posted to, uh, tonight at the top of chat. And, hmm. Uh, okay. Uh, otherwise, you could, yeah, you, know, you could try if it's <clears throat> if it blocks you again, you can DM me the uh, link and I'll put it in my chat myself. It should not start complaining about that. Okay, that was always with timeout warnings. Okay. A bit odd, since a timeout is supposed to block you from being able to post, not, uh, yeah, remove your old posts. And, yeah, it's it's showing up now. Uh, I'll actually give... I'll actually click on that at the moment. I'll copy the URL, so I can go take a look at that later. I think it should also appear in my own list of clips because it was made on my channel but i'm not entirely sure either way thank you for making the clip and okay the game is still behaving itself so we we didn't need to make the save but better to be safe anyways huh because it would have yep. sucked if we'd if the game had crashed there and we'd have to do all of that again we're on the right track uh -huh. the exit isn't far Oh dear. Hey, you recognize this place? Affirmative. Behind this door lies the cursed machine they used to rob me of half my memories. Yeah. Nothing else to say. You'll have to jump. I'm surprised. Why what? I used to yeah, say, I'm probably, probably if you're not giving him extra HP, but then he's just us to jump. <laughs> also, I missed this lid. The exit is that way, yes, but we also have uh, this here that we overlooked earlier. I kind of, I knew this was here around here somewhere, but I'd forgotten it was specifically here. Because, yeah, a hidden laboratory. And, well, we know how to disable these things now. So we just have to put these in place. Hmm. Actually... If we stand still for a bit... Okay, nope. I, for, for a moment I thought I was seeing Jade's breath uh, in the air, because these places are very obviously chilled. And, uh... Yeah. Uh, uh, freaking rats. And, yes, I know about the Easter egg, HS. <laughs> which is <laughs> what I was zooming on right at that second that that freaking rat bit me. What, Easter egg? Yeah. So, remember when I said that the same man behind this game is behind Rayman. Yes. Adeus Raymanus. This is the the mosquito uh, character 
from Rayman. They had a okay, miss. Okay, I've added it to my archives. I was unaware of this. <laughs> I wonder what you meant the cow was an Easter egg. <laughs> Or whatever that's supposed to be. A freaking <laughs> jump scared by a rat. <laughs> <sighs> and a free pearl. <laughs> Just for that. Oh, alien. And uh, yeah, uh, this is where the Reaper came from. Oh dear. But I believe that should be almost everything in the slaughterhouse. Or not the slaughterhouse, the fact the Nutripil factory. And we can double check with the pearls. Oh, there's one still on the map, but we actually know where that one is. There's two animals still on the map. Let's see, there's one over there on the fourth floor that we missed, and one on the fifth. Okay. We can come back for those another time. It's that way, Miss Jade. Uh, there isn't really a reward for getting 100%. Jade, an abandoned pearl down there. Yep, and we wouldn't have gotten that line if we'd collected it already. Huh. But yeah, there's no real need to go for 100% with outside. the with the uh, animal pictures. They are mostly for getting the extra pearls. And I believe there are actually more creatures than uh, you can get pearls for. Okay. Is Paige a member of the Iris Network? Could be. Don't ask me. All I know is how much he meant to me. Looks like you're finally getting your head back together again. You back with us? Getting there. But my head is killing me. The machine gave my brain a good scrubbing. I mean, now he's on a bit flat there a moment. Yeah, probably because <laughs> it is kind of killing him. And a bit on a fan theory is that... Uh, <clears throat> People have speculated, it isn't confirmed or anything in the game, but people speculate that at least some of the Alpha Sections are actually uh, guards from the Hillian army who have been brainwashed through torture, like Double H here. So yeah, had we shown up any later, uh, he could have been one of the Alphas. And yeah, if a character gets pinned down like that, they'll start taking damage if you don't knock it off. It... The mechanism is just over there. I should be able to clear the way. Yeah, and how does he clear the way? Okay. Oh yeah, but they were doing through. <laughs> Speaking of, I'll, I actually have something to link later. Uh oh. Yeah, at the end of the stream, before we do a raid, I have a clip. Or not a. I have a video to share. And okay, we can just put that in without getting zapped. Normally, turn off the power before you put in a fuse, or you will get zapped. It works. <laughs> This thing is eating up my insides. I, oh, I can't hold out much longer. The, the boys from Iris, they might be able to do something to help me. It's my only hope. Take me back to Iris. I'm begging you. I can't breathe, Miss Jade. I'm connecting to my auxiliary circuits, but they won't hold out very long. Quickly. You hanging in there? 
Yes, Miss Jade, but hurry. Oh, this thing is devouring me. And that is a part of what people is suspect uh, is part of the transformation into an alpha. So we really have to hurry. Oh, right, we were waiting for him. Um, is it this way? Yes, this is out. Uh, we can pick up the pearl some other time. For now, this, yeah, they are on to us. Okay, sorry about the frame rate there. And eight. Can you hear me? I did better. I can feel this thing gaining ground. HS clipped the jump scare. <laughs> I, I can't see a thing. Where are you, Miss Jade? Hello, Montgomery. Uh, yeah, he says he can't see, but he's still following after us. Why is Hillian? Hillis is in danger. Yep, that's the timer going off. But uh, it's kind of a bad time to uh, not to call it the end there, huh? Yeah. I, I can't see a thing. Where are you, Miss Jade? And yeah, we have plenty of time. Nino, May, quick! Double H is with me. He needs help. Double H reporting for duty. The Alpha Sections have taken possession of the... <coughs> they pursue the... at your service. Uh... Oh. Hub! Oh. Me, we have to give oh. him our last oh. dose of energy. Oh. Hub, oh. Hub, can you hear me? Oh. Say something. His pulse is dropping rapidly. Prepare the injection. I'm here, Hub. You're gonna be all right. Hang on, it's almost over. Thanks to you, Jade, Hub is safe. I just... He's a fighter. He'll be okay. He'll be back on his feet in a couple of weeks. Friends, I believe Jade has just shown us an amazing demonstration of courage. <laughs> nice work, kid. Good. Now come have a look. That's where the victims are taken. That's where they've taken your uncle, Jade. The old slaughterhouses. Your next report. Jade, your last report from the factory had a large impact on the population. The Hillians have spontaneously shown their support. Well, right back to business, huh? That was and quick. Yeah. Awkwardly quick. Uh, yeah, the, the game isn't perfect. Will he make it? He's past the worst of it, thanks to you. Uh, he just needs some rest now. Did you get my pictures of the factory? Of course, it's already been pasted and edited. You've done an incredible job. Be careful, Jade. And, yeah. There's more to the doms than just being uh, parasites. Have many of the agents from Iris been captured by the Alpha Sections? We use a maximum amount of precaution, but they're everywhere. We have been without word from our chief for several days now. The chief of the Hillis Section? None of us know his true identity. We can't go and help him, we don't even know where he is. If the Alpha Sections have the slaughterhouses occupied, well, we already know that. Most certainly, that seems to be where the traffic converges. It's going to be very difficult to get in there. And with converges, you can assume that, well, they bring in victims from elsewhere of the planet as well. Oh dear. Have the slaughterhouses become a military zone? Yep, they've got the whole place around it. Impossible to even get close. If I were you, I'd go have a look, look at the hovercraft races. I know that one of the racetracks is near the wall surrounding the slaughterhouses. If that's the case, you might be able to leave the race and get into the slaughterhouses from the track. 
There's no chance of going uh, out to sea thanks to their anti dance protection barriers. Which also so yeah, usefully corrals in the humans. And, well, <laughs> the humans and everything else on two legs. You should go see what the rhinos can do. Even though they're illegal now, I think they're still selling old jump kits for hovercrafts. Probably why they are illegal, for they don't want people to jump in the fence. This is Literally. You. It'll come in handy in the future. And, yeah. This is how you get a lot of these. There's just something so satisfying about that tune. <laughs> also, sorry about that. Uh, double, double, double H Iris. <laughs> uh, either that account has just been made just for this, or you <laughs> you picked the perfect game to come join Anon. Uh, yeah, they got. Yeah, you know, for some reason, Nightbot hit them with a spam warning. Even though all they did was say is it was well scream Carlson and Peters. I think it might have been the exclamation point. So I'll have to I'll have to check on Nightbot with that as well. Sorry about that. But yeah, this will be a perfect place to call it though. So yeah, sorry if you just turned up. <laughs> <laughs> There we go. Oh, blood, I can be sleepy. Uh, yeah, we are getting through this game pretty quickly, but I still love it. And there is still plenty of uh, to do. Uh, we could eventually go back around the, uh, to, uh, well, to get pictures of the animals that we've missed and to collect any pearls that we've missed, because, well, there's kind of one floating in the, <laughs> in the factory's uh, lake. Uh, <clears throat> but yeah for now we'll have to call it here though and continue next week so let's have a last check of the chat uh, da -da -da. Uh, double h iris no problem and hs with uh, a black market with weed smoking rhino seems legal to uh, seemed legal to me <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, thank you for the follow, Double H Iris. We will be seeing more of uh, you and of, well, Hub here next week on Tuesday, if nothing comes up. So for now, uh, I'll have to escape the game again for a moment through the task manager. And I'll have to add in a quick browser source in this. Because I want to show something that I found utterly hilarious when, when, I, when I found it. Uh, let me just open up a quick new tab of this. Then YouTube.com. And let's hope that I can remember the... Uh, let's hope that I can remember how it's named. Uh, let's see. Um, oh, unable to... Con oh, it's trying to... <laughs> Uh, yeah, the game tried to open up Double H's inventory, even though we're right next to them. Um, hmm, let's see. Well, how was? I will have to find it through one of the uh, one of the animator's other videos. So um, let's see. How was it again? Um, That might, yep, that found it. The animator that I'm looking at now is called Flippin' Ding Dong. And they are, they post very rarely, but they have very good animation. So I'm opening up one of their short bits here. And then I'll open up a, let's see, browser source. Add that in. Then copy over this into here, and let's see. Oh, oh, uh, that. Hmm. Okay, that doesn't really work. It. I'll have to just. Okay, that's that's trying to play the video on its own with, but so yeah, since 
since OBS doesn't have a, an account on YouTube, it tries to get them to get to get it to <clears throat> up uh, to make an account. So instead, we'll have to go with window capture then make that and then we select uh, to, uh, a brave.exe go and since that monitor has a bigger resolution then well the working space it did that for a bit it, wait why is it doing wait if i just make this full i actually that's completely blocked what i can see um hmm how to fix this to act then oh, right it's it's doing that because i have it oddly sized i'll I'll move OBS over to the other monitor for a moment. Uh, yeah, that is definitely too big still. Uh, believe me, this this annoyance is worth it because this it's a short little clip, but once <laughs> once you've seen this, you're probably going to love this uh, title. I went through the whole game unable to see this, and as you can see, this that's one of those alpha posters. So let's just go full screen for a moment. Actually, I should. I should show this to Drakir as well, of course, because otherwise he's going to, what the hell is he talking about? So change windows on Discord screen share to that one. Hmm. And uh, oh. okay, you, you're getting it down? I can see, I can see. Okay, then here we go. Wait. Stand aside, Miss Jade. I'll handle this. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> because that, that is basically what he does. <laughs> I've seen this before. I linked to it before, yeah. <laughs> Not you. So okay. I speed you to it, I think. Oh, it seems like Double H Iris has also seen that. Okay. Uh, before we raid, I'm going to put up a link to this guy's channel in the chat there. Uh, he doesn't have too much work, and it is slow going. I don't know if they're still too active. Their last thing that they uploaded was a year ago, but th this is this is really really good animation quality. So yeah, I definitely advise to give some of, of his stuff a, a look. <laughs> All right, enough of that. Let's see for anyone to raid. Must I put OBS back in its correct spot? England. And let's see. Azra Arcane is up, and oh, Potato is streaming again. Uh, maybe Did some one potato? new. <laughs> in a, a Tatum, a Potatum. They, there's someone I know. They're, they're actually the one I'm going to commission. Um. Let's see. Uh, Tatum is playing Minecraft, and uh, as for Arcane, is playing a game called Concrete Genie. I don't know that game. And then there's another guy, Viking Blonde. I've told you of him before, who is playing the Anna Crucis, another game I don't know. So. Which would you say we'd go for, Dirk? Here, who should we send everyone to? The one with the Minecraft. I, I am very sleepy head at the moment. Okay, then I'm going to put up a link in chat just to be certain, because last time I accidentally started the raid before HS was able to join. So there for anyone who wants to go manually. And then here goes the raid. Pote... No, no, accidentally put on caps lock. Pote... Um. There we go. Uh, I probably should have... I probably should have started that in the browser. Oh, oh well. 
<clears throat> okay. For now, though, thank you anyone who has been watching now or later. Uh, like I said, next week on Tuesday, if nothing comes up, we will be continuing with this great game. Uh, Saturday, we'll be playing more Monkey Island. So, yeah. Until next time, thank you again for watching. Uh, thank you, Double H Iris. Thank you, uh, HS180. And uh, there was someone at the start. Uh, let me double check. I think they left, but they are still wor worthy of a call out. Thank you as well, King Leon 2626. And yeah, until next time, have a nice day. And but until then, uh, I'm confusing myself now. <laughs> Thank you again for watching. Until next time, have a nice day, and until then. Be safe, folks, and have a pleasant sleep. <laughs> Good night. Sleep well.